Dr. Patel and you, Mrs. Patel for hosting us and Senator Um My name is Judy Hernandez. I am a 20 year resident of Park Sydney and a mom of two part of those alumni. Um, I came originally from the Bronx. I was the first person to attend college in my family and I um, earned an environmental engineering degree at Manhattan College. Um, I grew up in the 70s and the environmental movement was motivated me and the threat of global warming and a new EPA, I was excited to change the world. And then I started working. And I realized that politics um, plays a real important role in how progress is made or not made. Um, so that's part of the reason why I'm here today. Um, I came to Parsippany in 1999 with my young family, and I was privileged to be able to stay home with my kids and devote a lot of time to community work and their schooling and PTA, while still advocating for environmental and social issues. Um, in 2004, I started volunteering for local candidates because, as you had mentioned, I started seeing that local politics is, is where um, effective change is made. 2008, I joined the Pacific Democratic Committee. Um, I am a past member of the Open Space Committee appointed by Dr. former Mayor Luther. And I currently sit on the Parsippany Planning Board with Dr. Dave Jell, and I am on the Parsippany Environmental Committee, and I'm also on the Board of Trustees for the Parsippany Child Daycare Center. And being involved with those groups through the years, I realize and I've learned, after forging many relationships with people from differing political persuasions, that we really often on the town level have the same objectives and goals. So why am I running for council? I believe that Parsippany is undergoing a big change in development and growth. And I think that we need to control that destiny or, and have a vision for the future. And a vision, will, this, our vision for the future will define Parsippany for years to come, especially as we do our master plan at Parsippany. Um, they're gonna be, competing challenges to those goals. We have mandated fair housing goals in the state and for Persephone that are competing with our overcrowded schools. We have new development pressures and ever maddening traffic that we all deal with on the roads every day. Uh, we have the desire in the town for new parks and recreation, open space and green acres. We have the opportunity to revitalize some unused space in Persephone, <coughs> unused office space that's remaining vacant for years. And we have stormwater challenges and impacts, weather related impacts to our properties. I believe that smart development is um, growth, transparency, and, and we can improve our town. That's what smart development is all about. I believe that we need to sit, have a seat at the table and work with the developers and work with them, not for them, and dictate how our town grows. I believe that we need to maintain our um, character of our town, I, uh, protect our neighborhoods, safeguard our irreplaceable natural resources, and I believe that listening and going door to door for you to hear what you guys have to say is important because I want to represent you and have your voice. I believe that government is, a, is to represent the people. And I want to work with you and for you. And I would hope that you would want to participate as well because the democracy only works when everybody participates and everyone is heard. Um, Okay. Oh, that was it. <laughs> <laughs> so, so I am asking for your vote. I want us to take a, a, a step forward together, looking back at what we value, and hold on to our great diversity. Focus on our great diversity and look forward to our future. I believe that Parsippany has a lot of potential. I believe, and I hope you believe, in the potential for Parsippany as well. We are a great diverse community, and if we include all our talents, then we will all succeed greatly in Parsippany. Um, so I hope you believe in Parsippany's potential. I hope you believe in our campaign. And um, 
we would love you to support us if you want to, in any way you can, even if it's helping us knock on doors in some different communities that people would like. So go to hkh or persephone.com, correct? Yep. Yep. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much for your support. Thank you. Okay, and now Rob Kaminsky. Hi. Hi everyone, thanks for coming out tonight. My name is Rob Kaminsky. Um, I uh, live in Persephone most of my life. Um, I grew up in Lake Persephone. Uh, swimming, uh, boating, fishing, uh, ice skating, living the dream all year round. Um, it's a great place to grow up. Uh, I've been, I uh, graduated from Persephone High School. And um, from there, I went on to um, County College of Morris, got a uh, business degree in, uh, <clears throat> associate's degree in business administration. Um, from there, I joined the um, IBW, Local 102, um, International Government of Electrical Workers. Um, I've been there for 37 years. I'm on the executive board there. Um, from uh, there, my son, I have a son who's 29-year-old son. Um, he also is in the local. And he resides in Persephone, and um, he blessed me with uh, two beautiful granddaughters, Layla and Moan. Um, yeah, so I volunteer um, at the Persephone High School's snack stands, um, PAO buildings, um, to help uh, to do electrical work there and uh, keep the facilities running safely. I volunteer for um, Habitat for Humanity also to help provide those families uh, in need with affordable housing. So, um, you know, I'd like to um, get you guys out to vote for us on November 5th uh, and, um, you know, to help support our team. And, um, thank you for coming out tonight and um, hope to see you uh, November 5th. And last but never least, Corey Herbert. Hi everyone. Um, thank you, Dr. Patel and Mrs. Patel, for opening your home to us, and certainly as senator for joining us here all the way up in Morris County. Uh, my name is Corey Herbig. I am running for town council, obviously. Um, I uh, I live in Lake Hiawatha with my husband and my two kids. They are eight and five, so still very much young and upcoming through the school system of Persephone. Um, I am the director of state government affairs at Every Town for Gun Safety and Moms Demand Action for Gun Sense in America which means I basically spend my days figuring out the strategy to take the NRA down all over the country. Um, so I don't... Uh, <laughs> thank you. Um, so obviously I don't intimidate easily, and I promise you I will stand up for you. I'm not really afraid of anybody. <laughs> like the NRA in Texas and Florida and Oklahoma, I'm pretty sure I can handle whatever you're going to throw my way in person. Um, prior to joining Every Town for Gun Safety, I worked at the American Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Animals for 13 years, giving a voice to the voiceless um, and working against animal cruelty throughout our country. Uh, I also worked on legislative efforts there as well as at every town. Um, and prior to that, I worked as a housing attorney at Legal Services up in upstate New York um, to keep low-income families from being evicted, wrongfully evicted from their homes. So I pretty much spent my entire career fighting for families and animals and the people and those among us who don't have a voice for themselves or need somebody else to help them. Um, I'm, commi I'm committed to advocate. Um, I'm running for town council for a lot of reasons. First and foremost, I'm really tired of the partisan politics and watching it play out at every level of government. Uh, I am tired of watching our council pass meaningless resolutions instead of focusing on what is best for our town and what is right for our town. Uh, I know how the legislative process works. I've worked it from the other side of the coin for decades. Um, and I know that I can get things done at the local level. I know how to build a strategy. I know how to build the campaigns. I know how to move things through the process. Um, and I'm really excited about the prospect of helping Parsippany focus on the things that matter, like school safety and like our traffic issues in town, and like fiscal responsibility for our town. The issues that the town council, under its current form, uh, are not focused on. So with that, uh, thank you all again for coming out. Really excited to move forward with y'all in person. Sure, I just want to give a shout out to to Rapondi. Uh, she did an incredible job last year running for freeholders. It's important yes. that uh, she's paving the path for our candidate this year, but she has a very bright future ahead and it would be great to yes. see an Indian American in office.
tried to get her to move to Parsippany, but that's not going to work out. So I have to do something <laughs> higher, higher for you, my sister. All right. <laughs>